Hey there lovelies, my name is Mamta and welcome to my channel Geek Glitz in which I talk about all things geek and all things glitz. I make all sorts of videos, mainly Harry Potter, so feel free to browse through my channel to check out some of my past videos and make sure to hit that subscribe button if you like what you see. So today I'm in a bit of a holiday mood, hence the candy cane shirt, and I thought it would be fun to do a Harry Potter gift guide video for 2020. Now I did do a similar video last year and a lot of those gifts are still available so I'll link to that video below so that you guys can have more ideas. Today's video I'm going to cover a whole bunch of official and licensed merch that was released last year so it's all new items and I will be showing you some of them up close, some of them just pictures and I'll have the prices up on the video as well and I'll link to everything down below in my description as well as the stores where you can get them. And I'm also working on a small business gift guide video so that will be coming out in a couple of weeks too. So let me get started as there's a lot to get through. So first up, I have got this Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone edition by Mina Lima Design and it is gorgeous, the most stunning book ever. It's easily my favorite edition of the Philosopher's Stone that's ever been released. So this is a signed edition that I got, so it's got their signatures in it, Mina Lima's. So that's available from their website. So what's fun about this book is that there are a lot of gorgeous illustrations in here, as well as interactive elements. So it's a really great collectible. So there's like pop-ups and stuff, and there's just so much to explore. Any Potterhead would love it. So you can get this from any bookstore, or from Mina Lima Design for the signed version. So continuing with books, Inside Editions always makes some great ones and I really like their new Diagon Alley pop-up book that they've released and it is so cool. I don't own it but just from pictures I could tell it's so amazing so I think that would make a great collectible for a Potterhead. And I'd also recommend this Dot Journal by Inside Editions because it's got a dotted grid so that's perfect for bullet journaling and would be great for a planner for the new year. And next, one of my favorite ideas for a gift this year is this fill-in gift book by Running Press. So it's basically a book full of prompts that you would personalize and fill out for the loved one in your life. So it says you're magical, you put to whoever it is and from who. And inside there are so many prompts that you could fill out and personalize to them. So there's one here that says, if we had entries in the monster book of monsters, I would be called a blank and you would be a blank. And the blank is where you would fill it out. So there's so many prompts in here with great illustrations from the film. And I just think it's such a great idea for a gift. I'm gonna make my sister fill this one out for me. And next, going back to the idea of organization and planning, I would recommend this Daily Planner Notepad by Conquest Journals because it's fantastic. So it's a 50 page daily planner notepad and it's got prompts for each day that allows you to fill in a to-do list, has a meal planner, some trackers, some appointments. So it's fun for any Potterhead to stay organized. And the thing about Conquest Journals is they have a lot of other planning items as well. Some beautiful planners, beautiful notepads, as well as some gorgeous washi tape. So I definitely check them out for some great planning gift ideas. And next, I think Thunder Bay Press is another great company that has some fantastic Harry Potter items. So I would recommend this Harry Potter sticker art puzzle book by them because it's such a great idea for any Harry Potter puzzle lovers. So it features scenes from the films that are basically available as sticker puzzles that you need to put together. And all of the puzzles end up in a single space inside the book so it doesn't take up much space at all and is a great idea. I also think this Harry Potter embroidery kit by Thunder Bay Press would also also make a great gift for any Potterhead that loves crafts as well. And next up, I think Fanatic is another awesome company that has made making some stunning Harry Potter collectible items this year and I'm just so impressed by them. They've actually sent me a couple of their products in the past few months and I'm just completely floored by their designs and how unique they are. So for instance, this silver plated ticket, which is the Hogwarts Express ticket, is one of my favorite items by them. It is a limited edition product and it's just so beautiful and will look so great on a shelf. They've got similar tickets for the Quidditch final as well as a Yule Ball ticket. And other collectible items that I would recommend by them are their limited edition coins and these are numbered in the back so they're individually numbered which is so cool. They've got characters like Harry and Voldemort, they've also got Ron and Hermione, and they've also got other coins from their Dumbledore's Army collection. So collectible coins is a great idea for a Potterhead. They've also got some limited edition jewelry items like this Dumbledore's Army necklace which is just so beautiful. And next, I think Harry Potter candles are another great gift idea and Charmed Aroma makes some fantastic ones. So I have this Golden Snitch one by them which I think is so cool and each of their candles comes with a jewelry piece inside so I got a necklace inside this one and what's great is that once the candle is melted I could reuse this golden snitch 
for storing trinkets or something. So it's such a functional item. And they've also got other great Harry Potter candles too, like some Hogwarts house themed ones, even a Horcrux themed one. And I love it that they each have their own jewelry piece. It's a lot of fun. So next, Build-A-Bear came out with a Harry Potter range of bears this year. And they've got robes for their bears, which are so cute, like Hogwarts house robes. So I got a Ravenclaw themed one and this little bear is called Luna. And what I love about their bears is that they have paws that say Harry Potter on one side and a Hogwarts crest on the other side. And they do have other ones that have like house themed uh, crests on their bears as well. And so they've got robes for them as well as Quidditch robes. And they've even got a sorting hat now and a Hogwarts Express. So a lot of fun accessories for a Harry Potter themed Build-A-Bear. And next, the Wizarding World came out with a Harry Potter fan club pin seeking collection this year in which they featured a bunch of house set pins. So this is a Ravenclaw one that I get, which I think is so cool. It came with a set of six pins and they had similar pins for all the other houses too. They also periodically release other pins too like this fun sorting hat locket pin but the thing is they do tend to sell out really fast especially if they're exclusive so having a Wizarding World Gold membership gives early access as well as gives a discount so that would be something to consider as a bonus gift to give a Potterhead if you were thinking about giving them some items from the pin seeking collection. And earlier this year Vera Bradley released a Harry Potter collection too with their fun pattern called the Home to Hogwarts pattern. So I got a pouch in that collection, which I covered in greater detail in a separate video. But the thing is, they have a lot of items available with this pattern as well as some other Harry Potter items too. So I would check out their collection for more gift ideas. And if you want some Harry Potter clothing ideas, Unique Vintage came out with a bunch of fun Harry Potter dresses this year as well as some other items. And the great thing about their collection is that they had plus sizes too. And then Cakeworthy is another company that recently came out with a fun Harry Potter clothing line. So they've got some Harry Potter Hogwarts house shirts like in plaid as well as a cool daily profit shirt among many other items and of course a Harry Potter themed wand is always a great gift idea and the Wizarding World recently came out with a fun collection of exclusive designs so it's really beautiful they've got designs of the Hogwarts castle a Phoenix themed wand even the Hogwarts house animals and things like the Hogwarts house artifacts so like a Gryffindor sword themed wand a Ravenclaw diadem themed wand so a lot of fun ones and they're available in the WB studio tour shop like they are online shop as well as the new Harry Potter New York online shop and from those same shops you can also get a personalized Hogwarts robe so you can get someone a robe with their name embroidered on it which is such a cool idea and a unique but pricey gift idea this year is the Monte Grappa Harry Potter fountain pen I actually own the Hogwarts version of this pen and I've been having a lot of fun with it and they have it available for all the other houses too and most recently they've also released like a Hogwarts themed pen pouch for it as well as some limited edition fountain pen inks like Harry Potter themed ones so it is a bit of a pricey gift but it would make a fancy collectible and next up I'm gonna talk about some Harry Potter jewelry so Cine Replicas actually has some great Harry Potter jewelry pieces this year and they sent me some of them and I'm actually wearing one of them. This time turner necklace is so cool. It's got sand that actually moves and it spins. So it's a great movie replica of Hermione's time turner necklace. They've also got some Hogwarts house themed chokers as well as a fun Harry Potter charm bracelet. And then Alex and Annie is always a great choice for some Harry Potter jewelry too. They've recently got a really gorgeous Hogwarts house necklace collection. So they have it available for each of the houses. It's a lovely pink pendant with a adjustable shiny gold necklace. So I have the Ravenclaw one here just to show you guys because I thought it was so cute. And then of course, they've also got some gorgeous bracelets and every month they come out with a new Harry Potter design. And then Pandora, of course, has some great Harry Potter charms. And this year they released a couple more. I did do a review video of their new charms earlier this year. And then most recently, they've also released a fun time turner charm which would make a great gift and then finally the last company i want to talk about is freeman jewelry which makes some gorgeous harry potter jewelry so they've got some lovely necklaces and in particular i love their mirror of Arisid necklace these are a bit pricey though and they are fine jewelry but they would make some great gifts so that's it i hope you found some harry potter gift ideas through this video because there was a lot of new harry potter merch this year so let me know below in the comments which of these items you loved best and which of them are you thinking of gifting to someone or getting for yourself? And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and please subscribe to my channel Geek Glitz for more things geek and more things glitz. And make sure to hit that notification bell to be informed when my new videos are up. And like I mentioned before, I do 
have a small business gift ideas video coming up soon too. So stay tuned for that and feel free to connect with me on any of my social media. I've listed them all below in the description. I have got a Facebook, a Twitter and an Instagram. So come say hello as I love to hear from you. Thank you so much for watching lovelies. See you in the next video. Bye.